For the third day in a row, Gulf waters are churning along Alabama beaches. Double red flags are flying along most of our beaches, indicating a dangerous surf. And that advisory still in effect. Waters are closed to swimmers. Helping to guard those waters, a state trooper helicopter, but on a limited basis. As WKRG News 5's Debbie Williams reports, that all changed today. Now helping to guard Alabama's beaches on a full-time basis, a state trooper helicopter not only keeping an eye on trouble spots, but when needed, dropping rescue swimmers where they are needed most. We started this about three years ago. Um, and so this is just an increase in those efforts that, that we've already seen. In a matter of minutes, that helicopter can be from the floor of Bama all the way to Fort Morgan. Getting those swimmers in the water that quickly will save lives. What we are going to see is more patrols. State Senator Chris Elliott helped spearhead efforts to secure $400,000 in state funding, translating into 70 to 100 chopper trips along the coast each year. That allows us not only to be able to respond quickly, but to be in the air already. From the air, a different perspective of the big waves, dangerous currents in the Gulf, and why the waters are closed to swimmers. Kind of like going to an amusement park and the roller coaster's closed. You know, I understand the dis disappointment. This is a completely different animal from that. This, this Gulf is relentless. Having that eye in the sky and a rescue swimmer on board can be the difference the next time someone yells, for help. On the Baldwin County Beat in Gulf Shores, Debbie Williams, WKRG News 5.